Please hold your applause till all the PharmDs have received their degree. Uh, the second row may stand. Stephan Stephanie Newman. Dr. Newman was a member of the American Society of Health Systems Pharmacy, American Pharmacists Association. She was on the dean's list for every semester during her tenure at our school. She worked as an intern at Niagara Falls Memorial Medical Center, and she hopes to become a clinical pharmacy and to, to study and implement insulin protocols for improved blood glucose control in diabetic patients. Congratulations, Dr. Newman. Tracy Nagel. Dr. Nagel was a member of the American Pharmacists Association, the American Society of Health Systems Pharmacists. She did an internship at Roswell Park Institute, and her future plans are to become an oncology pharmacist or work as an in-home medication therapy management pharmacist. Congratulations, Dr. Nagel. Peggy Mann. Dr. Mann was a member of the American Pharmacists Association, the Western New York Council of Health Systems Pharmacists. She has worked as an intern at Rite Aid Pharmacy, and she's accepted a position with Rite Aid as a pharmacist in the Southern Tier. Congratulations, Dr. Mann. Megan Nelson. Dr. Nelson was a member of the Pharmacists Association of Western New York, the American Pharmacists Association. She worked as an intern at 2121 Main Street Pharmacy in Main Street in Buffalo and she's accepted a position at, with Rite Aid as a pharmacist in Ithaca, New York. Congratulations, Dr. Nelson. Matthew Agosti. Dr. Agosti was a member of the American Pharmacists Association, American Society of Health Systems Pharmacists. He worked as an intern with CVS Pharmacy, where he hopes to obtain a, a pharmacist position. His research were the direct effects of sustained niacin or platelet aggregation under the direction of Dr. Nicholas Norgard. Congratulations, Dr. Agosti. Nicholas Scalzo. Dr. Scalzo was a member of the American Pharmacists Association and the Pharmacy Association of Western New York. He achieved the dean's list for every semester while he was in school. He worked as an intern all four years for Rite Aid and he's accepted a community pharmacy position with Rite Aid Pharmacy in the Western New York area. Congratulations, Dr. Scalzo. Drew Lambert. Dr. Lambert was a member of the American Pharmacists Association student chapter serving as secretary, the American Society of Health Systems Pharmacy. He was also on the dean's list each semester. Uh, he received University Honor Scholar in 2008 and 2009. He worked as an intern for Wegmans Pharmacy, and he'll be doing a first year pharmacy residency at LeeCom Mill Creek Community Hospital in Erie, Pennsylvania. Congratulations, Dr. Lambert. Joseph Brennan. Dr. Brennan was a member of the American Pharmacists Association, American Society of Hospital Pharmacists. Uh, he's accepted a position with Walmart Pharmacy, and his research was the modulation of the inflammatory response by diabetic management under the advisement of Alice Ceccarino. Congratulations, Dr. Brennan. Eugene Prespo. Now we'll go to Michael Cardamo. Eugene Prespo, yes, yeah, sorry. Came out sooner than he was supposed to. Uh, he was a member of the American Pharmacists Association uh, the American Society of Health Systems Pharmacists, must be those white shoes. <laughs> he worked as an intern at the Roswell Park Cancer Institute uh, until the present time, and his future plans hopefully to a position with Rite Aid Pharmacy. His research was evaluating the clopidogrel proton pump inhibitor interaction by comparing platelet aggregation to ADP with clopidogrel in the presence of proton pump inhibitors under the directions of Dr. Fran Django. Congratulations, Dr. Prespo. Michael Cardamone. Dr. Cardamone was a member of the American Pharmacists Association, the Student Pharmacists Association of Western New York. He worked as an intern for CVS Pharmacy, and he would be practicing community pharmacy in the Buffalo, Rochester area. Congratulations, Dr. Cardamone. Jessica Geyser. 
Dr. Geyser is a member of the American Pharmacists Association, the Student Pharmacists Association of Western New York, the, student so the Western New York Society of Health Systems Pharmacy. She worked as an intern for Kmart Pharmacy, and she plans on working for Kmart after graduation. She's also looking at the possibility of becoming an owner of an independent pharmacy. Congratulations, Dr. Geyser. Allison Pittman. Dr. Pittman was a member of the Phi Delta Chi Professional Pharmacy Fraternity, the Student Society of Health Systems Pharmacy. She worked as an intern at St. Joseph Hospital in Chittawaga, and she's accepted a first-year pharmacy practice residency with a pediatric focus at the Women's and Children's Hospital of Buffalo starting in July. Congratulations, Dr. Pittman. Christina Manchaki. Dr. Manchaki was a member of the Phi Delta Chi Pharmacy Fraternity, the Rokai Academic Honor Society. She worked as an intern at CVS Pharmacy the years that she was here, and she is pursuing a first year pharmacy residency in ambulatory care at the University at Buffalo Lifetime Health. Congratulations, Dr. Manchaki. Andrew Stivers. Dr. Stivers is a member of the, Phi, the Phi Delta Chi Pharmaceutical Fraternity, the University at Buffalo Student Society of Health Systems Pharmacists, Phi Lambda Sigma Honor, Honor Society. He worked as an intern from Buffalo at Buffalo General Hospital the years he was here at the school, and he will be pursuing a first-year pharmacy practice residency at Riverside Methodist Hospital in Columbus, Ohio. Congratulations, Dr. Stivers. Michelle Kite. Dr. Kite was a member of the American Pharmacists Association, the Student Pharmacists Association of Western New York, and the Western New York Society of Health Systems Pharmacists. She will begin a pharmacy internship at Oak Ridge's Pharmacy in Richmond Hill, Ontario, Canada in June, and working towards becoming a licensed pharmacist in the province of Ontario. Congratulations, Dr. Kite. Danielle Baldwin. Dr. Baldwin was a member of the American Pharmacists Association, the American Society of Health Systems Pharmacists. She was a member of the Rokai National Honor Society. She received the University at Buffalo Pharmacy Violet and Cecil Newton Scholarship Award. She worked as an intern at Walgreens Pharmacy, and she's accepted a staff pharmacist position at St. Peter's Hospital in Albany, New York. Congratulations, Dr. Baldwin. Lauren Perna Petrozolo. Dr. Petrozello was a member of the American Pharmacists Association, the Pharmacists Association of Western New York, and the Western New York Society as Health Systems Pharmacists. She worked as a pharmacy intern at the Kenmore Mercy Hospital in Island Prescription Center, and she has accepted a position as a pharmacist in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Congratulations, Dr. Perna Petrozello. Christina Hall. Dr. Hall, whose sister is a graduate of our program and also a pharmacist, uh, was curriculum coordinator for the past few years of her class, curriculum committee member for the past few years. She was a University at Buffalo School of Pharmacy Student Leader Recognition Award. She worked as a pharmacy intern at Parkview Health Services, and she hopes to pursue a career as a long-term care pharmacist. Congratulations, Dr. Hall. Rebecca Tate. Dr. Tate is a member of the American Pharmacists Association, the Pharmacist Society of the State of New York. She's a member of the Rokai National Honor Society. She worked as an intern at Sisters of Charity Hospital St. Joseph's uh, campus for the four years she was here. And she has accepted a position as a, a, a Quorum IV infusion pharmacist in Quorum IV. Congratulations, Dr. Tate. Jerry Altshuler. Dr. Altshuler was a member of the American Clinical College of Pharmacists, the American Society of Hospital Pharmacists, Student Society of Health Systems Pharmacists. He worked as a pharmacy intern at Duane Reed Pharmacy in New York City, and he's accepted a first year residency at the New York University Medical Center. Congratulations, Dr. Altshuler. They'll get it. <laughs> Congratulations, Dr. Altshuler.
the row may sit down. The next row may rise. Robert Seabury. Dr. Seabury is a member of the Kappa Psi Pharmaceutical Fraternity, Vice President of the Rokai National Honor Society. He worked as a pharmacy intern the last four years with Rite Aid, and he will be suing a primary pharmacy residency in Upstate uh, Medical Center. Congratulations, Dr. Seabury. And Yella Markut. Dr. Markut was a member of the Kappa Psi Pharmaceutical Fraternity, the uh, pharmacy, uh, pharmacy Leadership Society, Phi Lambda Sigma, she worked as an intern all four years at Alden Pharmacy, and she's hoping to pursue a career as a compounding pharmacy in community. Congratulations, Dr. Markud. Christopher Chan. Dr. Chan was a member of the Kappa Psi Pharmaceutical Fraternity, the Rokai National Honor Society, the American Society of Health Systems Pharmacists, and the American Pharmacists Association. He worked as an intern at Shoppers Drug Mart in Canada for the past four years, and he'll be working back in, back in Canada as a community pharmacist. Congratulations, Dr. Chan. Elizabeth Panfill. Dr. Panfill is a member of the Kappa Psi Pharmaceutical Fraternity, the Cigna Yearbook, the American Pharmacist Association, the American Society of Health Systems Pharmacy. She was a pharmacy intern at Walmart Pharmacy for the past four years and she's going to work for Walmart as a pharmacy in the Cleveland, Ohio area. Congratulations, Dr. Panfill. <coughs> Alyssa Marie Ostrander. Dr. Ostrander was a member of the Kappa Psi Pharmaceutical Fraternity, the American Society of Health Systems Pharmacists, the American Pharmacists Association. She won a Kappa Psi Scholarship Award in 2010. She worked as an intern for Walgreens Pharmacy for the past four years, and she's accepted a position with Walgreens as a pharmacist. Congratulations, Dr. Ostrander. Esther Huang. Doctor, excuse me, it's, Dr., it's Huang. Dr. Huang was co-treasurer for the School of Pharmacy Student Association, co-editor of the Cigna UB Pharmacy Yearbook. She's a member of the School of Pharmacy Student Association. She worked as an intern for Topps Pharmacy the last four years, and she's accepted a primary pharmacy residency in the program at Beth Israel Medical Center. Congratulations, Dr. Huang. Rizarta Lako. Dr. Lako is the American Pharmacist Association, American Students of Pharmacy Treasurer, American Society of Health Systems Pharmacy, the Pharmacist Society of the State of New York, and she was an intern at the Sisters of Charity Hospital in Buffalo, New York. She's accepted a first year pharmacy residency at the University of Rochester Medical Center. Congratulations, Dr. Lako. Ajita Patel. Dr. Patel is a member of the American Pharmacists Association Student of Pharmacists and the Canadian Association of the Pharmacy Students and Interns, the Pharmacists Association of Western New York. She worked at Shoppers Drug Mart and Summit Park Pharmacy for the last few years as an intern, and she plans to pass her Canadian board exams in order to become a licensed pharmacist in Ontario, Canada. She'll be working at Panacea Pharmacy, an independent pharmacy in Woodbridge, Ontario, starting in July. Congratulations, Dr. Patel. Richard Brecker. Dr. Brecker was a student member of the New York State Council of Health Systems Pharmacy, the American Pharmacists Association. He actually worked the very first drug disposal program with me in, in uh, Rochester, New York. He worked as an intern at the Women's and Children's Hospital of Buffalo, and he, is ex he would like to accept a, an Amer a American Society Health Systems Pharmacy first year pharmacy res hospital residency. Congratulations, Dr. Brecker. Marissa Lewingrub. Dr. Lewingrub is a member of the American Society of Health Systems Pharmacists, American College of Clinical Pharmacy, Western New York Society of Health Systems Pharmacy. She was on the Dean's List every semester while she was in our program. She worked as an intern for CVS Pharmacy all the, all the years she was here, and she's accepted a first year pharmacy residency at the Mount Sinai Medical Center. Congratulations, Dr. Lewingrub. Lindsay Cole. Dr. Cole was a member of the Phi, Lambda, excuse me, Phi Delta Chi Pharmacy Society, 
She was a Steen's student ambassador. She was a member of the Western New York Society of Health Systems Pharmacists and the Pharmacists Association of Western New York. She worked for Rite Aid Pharmacy in Buffalo and Rochester since beginning our program. And she's accepted a position with Rite Aid as a pharmacist in Rochester. Congratulations, Dr. Cole. Lisa Marie Kruszewski. Dr. Kruszewski was a student, Dean Student Ambassador, a member of the Phi Delta Chi Pharmacy Fraternity, a member of the American Society of Health Systems Pharmacists, Western New York Society of Health Systems Pharmacists, American Pharmacists Association. She worked as an intern at both Rite Aid Pharmacy and Buffalo General Hospital. And she's accepted a first year pharmacy residency at the training program at the Yale New Haven Hospital in New Haven, Connecticut. Congratulations, Dr. Kruszewski. Gabrielle Reardon. Dr. Reardon was a member of the Phi Delta Chi Pharmacy Fraternity, the Rho Chi National Honor Society. She was a Dean's Ambassador. She received a Certificate of Excellence in Pharmaceutical Science courses. She worked as an intern at Rite Aid Pharmacy. And she'll be moving to Raleigh, North Carolina and will be working as a pharmacist at Rite Aid in Mount Olive, North Carolina. Congratulations, Dr. Reardon. Taylor John Topping. Dr. Topping was a member of the American Pharmacists Association, American Society of Health Systems Pharmacists. He's been a Dean Student Ambassador. He has worked as an intern for Rite Aid Pharmacy and Kenmore Mercy Hospital. And he's accepted a first year pharmacy residency at the University of Rochester Medical Center. Congratulations, Dr. Topping. Jackson Maina. Dr. Maina was a member of the American Pharmacists Association, American Society of Health Systems Pharmacists, the Pharmacist Society of the State, Pharmacist Society of the State of New York. He's accepted an inpatient pharmacy position at the Franklin Medical Center in Western Massachusetts. Congratulations, Dr. Maina. Kyle Iannotti. Dr. Iannotti is a member of the Student Pharmacists Association of Western New York, the student liaison to the Western New York Society of Health Systems Pharmacists. He worked as a pharmacy intern for the Menges and Curtis Apocothecary and the CVS Pharmacy. And he hopes to obtain a hospital pharmacy position in the state of Virginia. Congratulations, Dr. Iannotti. Hai Chan. Dr. Chan is a member of the American Pharmacists Association, American Society of Health Systems Pharmacists. He's worked for the past four years at CVS Pharmacy, and he's currently committed to CVS Pharmacy, but eventually wants to open an independent pharmacy himself. Congratulations, Dr. Chan. Stephen Tarbell. Dr. Tarbell is a member of the American Pharmacists Association, the Alaska Pharmacists Association. He received the Indian Health Services Scholarship. He worked as a, as a pharmacy intern for Wegmans Pharmacy in Geneseo, New York. And he plans on marrying the next candidate <laughs> and working as a full-time pharmacist at the Native Health Center in Anchorage, Alaska. Congratulations, Dr. Tarbell. You're all dying to know Justine Kirsch, <laughs> soon to be Dr. Tarbell. Dr. Kirsch is a member of the American Pharmacists Association and the Alaska Pharmacists Association. Uh, she worked as an intern at both Fillmore Pharmacy and Walgreens Pharmacy, and she plans to work as a full-time pharmacist for Walgreens Pharmacy in Anchorage, Alaska, to be with her husband. Congratulations, Dr. Kirsch. Brian Selvis. Dr. Selvis is a member of the National Community Pharmacists Association, the Western New York Society of Health Systems Pharmacists. He currently is working as an intern for CVS Caremark, and he has accepted a position with CVS Caremark, but eventually would like to own his own independent pharmacy. Congratulations, Dr. Selvis. And this row may sit down. <laughs> 